The Pool in the Graveyard by Gravela MacDonald By this corner of the graveyard, the red dawn discovered to Jonas a little pool of clear water with mosses and parsley ferns all around it, and so clear and cool-looking that he must drink. The larger part of it was still shadowed by the wall. On knees and hands, he put his lips to it and drank. The refreshment was wonderful. He rose with a sense that he should find the lost sheep yet and bring her home. He looked down once more into the clear pool. It was wider than he had thought. Indeed, he had been mistaken. It was a great tarn on the mountainside. Then he saw that wonderful things were happening on the face of and all around the water. What appeared to be little glowworms were lying motionless in groups on the mosses in a still-shadowed region by the side of the water. From beneath a low arch in the wall, where the water was slowly forming a way in a river, there came against stream and wave and wind a fishing boat. Its great red sail was spread, and its pennant shone silvery blue in the sun. It came alongside a pier of mossy stones and cast anchor. From it leapt twelve strong young fishermen, all with bright faces. They took up the little creatures with the glowing lights and carried them aboard, then back again to other groups, until all were gathered in. For they were all sleeping human forms, close wrapped in grave clothes, but with their lights still living, as might be seen by anyone who had suffered. When all were safe aboard, the men cast off, and the boat disappeared under the arch.